Hello and welcome to the second segment of airbedrepair.com. This is going to give you some helpful tips on how to repair your sleep number bed in a way that is going to reinforce the sides of the air chambers. Basically what you're trying to do is provide firm support on all four sides so that the air chamber only responds to your body on the top. And then the layers of foam in there are going to provide comfort or support. Uh, the support foam that we use is a open cell design, it's breathable, and it's layered in two inch layers. And what that means is down here below your foam rail, or, or below the layers is your foam rails, which encapsulates your air chambers underneath. And you can have one layer of foam, which would probably be the softest that we offer. Two layers is going to get a little firm. And then of course, if you go with three, it's gonna be extra firm. And this is probably the firmest bed I've ever built. So if this is what you're looking for, we definitely have it. And then combine it with the bamboo cool to touch fabric on the top, we're gonna to go ahead and finish this mattress up. This is actually a full size bed that we just put together. And we've got all the layers of foam inside. Um, Basically what you try to do is layer the top panel over the side panel and just pull it straight even and it's going to square everything up and hold everything in there tightly. And the concept behind ending the bed sagging is really just providing firm support on all four sides of the air chambers because without that firm support they're not going to be able to respond to the top. So a lot of people end up pushing the number way up high to 100 and trying to add more support, but all it does is round the air chamber. Your sides can still fall over and the foam comfort layers can definitely break down. So this is our new design. I hope you enjoy it. You can read more about us on airbedrepair.com and I look forward to hearing from you. You can give me a call at 314-599-2777. Make it a great day.